Chloe has some practice in place. Place is a boundary state. She can eat on it, sleep on it, walk, lay down, um, sit down, do whatever she wants on it. She just can't be vocal and she can't break the command. So place is really great if you have people coming over and Chloe wants to be too much in the face. Um, you can put her on a place by the door so she can still see them, but she can't go greet them yet. Um, and then they can just come up to her and say hi. If you guys have an unfinished backyard, you can put her on a place outside. That way you're sure you have control of where she is and she's not running away or running off to go and do whatever. Um, if she likes to beg at the dining room table, you can put Chloe on a place so she has to stay there and can't be trying to take people's food. But she's still, in it, she's still able to be around the family then. So if Chloe were to break a place, you take, you calmly go up to her, grab her leash, and tell her no Chloe place, and pop and release all the way back to the place mat until she's fully on. Um, if she's being vocal in place, you do the same thing. You grab it, and you could pop down and pop up and tell her no Chloe place. Huh? Yes. When give, if Chloe's doing great, you can give her treats for being on place. So you're just gonna take the treat and put it directly on the mat, and you can tell a good place Chloe. If she's been doing great and it's time to come off, all you have to do is tell a Chloe free. Good girl. And when you want to put Chloe on place, all you have to do is tell a Chloe place. Good girl. 